Today, we are going to learn how to make beeswax candles. I'm Farmer Katie, and I'm also a beekeeper. So what I've done is prep some of this already, but number one rule to melting beeswax down, you must cover your surface. So I open up a garbage bag and I cover the area I'm working because no matter what, you are going to make a mess. And beeswax is not fun to get off of things, especially textured surfaces. So I used cheesecloth and I've done many batches and I put my cheesecloth in this pan and inside of this is about an inch of water. And then I put my cheesecloth in, my wax in, I stir it with plastic. Always use plastic utensils because you can throw them away because it's not fun to get all this off of your nice silverware. So I have some wax going here and this was this was some messy wax so I'm actually going to melt it down again and kind of skim stuff off because I found some really old stuff downstairs. So here's an example of our beeswax and now this is what I can melt down again and pour into a candle mold. So we're going to go over and see the other area where the candles are going. So here's the silicone mold. I've already put the candle wick through the mold itself. And we're going to spray it with some cooking spray. And then I have my container here to keep all the wax off the counter so we don't get spots like that on the counter. <laughs> I have a plastic dish that I will dip into. This is a double boiler with our wax. And we're gonna fill the candle up. Mom, if you come over here and look inside the candle. So we're just getting our wax out. And then we just fill this up, the silicone. And don't worry about your wick right now. We're gonna center it. Kind of go to the meniscus of the thing. I'm not sure if that's good or not. It seems like they do, it does shrink in a little. And then here's more, we have a piece of wire that we can prop this up and put it in the center. Be careful, this is hot. Might have to pull our, wi our wick out just a little. So anyway, I'm gonna work on this and we'll show you one of the finished products. So here's an example of the mold. It's just silicone, it doesn't look like much. It has a hole for the wick, it has a rubber band to hold the mold together because it has a slit in it. And in theory, this is what we're going to get out of it. So you make sure, because I've forgotten this part twice, make sure to spray the inside of your mold with just like a cooking spray. And then your candle should pop right out. So right here, I'm, I'm separating that, but I know the bees are on this side. So I'm pulling that away. And here, Dad, go ahead and pull that. Press. Yeah. And hopefully our wick stays in it. Ta-da! Ooh. There it is. And awesome. Now we'll do another one. Make sure to subscribe so you get more <laughs> great videos on homesteading and health and turkeys and chickens and sheep and cows. So hit that like button and subscribe.